Mark, tell me a bit about the symptoms of acute pancreatitis. How do children present? That is difficult and has often caused delays in diagnosis because the symptoms are pretty nonspecific. So the most common symptom is abdominal pain. Uh, the pain is usually higher up in the abdomen and can be very sharp and disabling pain. Rarely it will radiate to the back, so the children will have pain in their back as well, but that may seem to be more common in adults than in children. Vomiting uh, is a symptom as well, although it's not uh, particularly common. There are other rare things like fever and jaundice that can happen along with pancreatitis. I think it's also important for pediatricians to remember that the presentation may be different in younger children. So under the age of three, um, the originating complaint may be abdominal distension. Sometimes it's irritability, which may or may not be a manifestation of pain in nonverbal children. And fever is actually much more common in the younger children than it is in older children. But in both age groups, uh, the symptoms are quite nonspecific, and the physician who has seen that patient needs to think about pancreatitis and do appropriate testing. That's a really important point, the fact that they're, the symptoms are so nonspecific, and so it does create challenges in the community for diagnosis.